Hello friends and today we are going to discuss one important topic about how do these remedies work, how do they actually uh, relieve us. But before we understand how do they relieve us, actually we need to understand why do we suffer, why does there is a dis-ease. Uh, so when we can understand why there is a dis-ease, then only we can understand how these remedies can ease us. So dis-ease is primarily uh, at the emotional level because of uh, certain unresolved emotion, negative emotions. Now what do you mean by unresolved negative emotions? Uh, we often uh, land up into situations every day, every hour actually, where uh, we have some kind of un, uh, negative emotions that we, 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 we face. Like for example, um, a patient says, uh, uh, doctor, you had given me some medicine, but it didn't work at all. So I was not at all relieved. In fact, it got aggravated. Uh, so my complaints, in fact, they, they increased. Uh, so this is a this is a negative feedback that you are getting. Uh, obviously, nobody feels happy. Uh, obviously, uh, a doctor would feel disappointed. Uh, he will feel sad. He will feel not good primarily. So there will be varied emotions that varied uh, states of emotions, varied degrees of emotions, varied shades of emotions that a person can have. Somebody might just feel nothing or somebody will feel sad, somebody might feel uh, disappointed, but somebody can feel uh, himself or herself uh, as a failure. Now this is a, this is a negative, all these are the negative emotions, but usually what happens is Whenever we go ahead with the follow-up, we go ahead with the prescription, we usually change something and we give it to the patient. We tell the patient, okay, this might happen, but I'm changing the medicine now. Let's see uh, if this can give you the desired result that uh, you are expecting. Now, this is resolution of that negative state. This is a re resolution of that negative emotion. But in case it doesn't resolve, then it lands into a phase of unresolved negative emotion. Like a patient comes to me and tells me or two or three patients, they come to me and tell me on a particular day that your medicines are not working or the last medicine that you gave that, that was not working. If I consider myself as a loser or a failure and if I don't resolve that with a rational thought, then the unresolved emotion of feeling yourself as a loser because of those uh, disappointments because of those failures because of those obstacles can stay with you and then that will try to create a dis-ease in you dis-ease at the level of emotions and if that stays longer or it stays with a more deeper and intense uh, character then it can even percolate to a physical level by some psychosomatic illness so this is unresolved negative state of feeling yourself as a loser, which is a consistent phase that you are into, uh, which stays with you and it has been unresolved. So unresolved negative emotions can or will or they land us into a dis-ease state. Now what does these remedies do? Flower, batch flower remedies, they basically act on these unresolved negative emotion state. We have seen Mimulus, the, the earlier video that we saw, that was Mimulus. Now Mimulus has a fear of specific things, so it's a fear of dogs. Now everybody, most of the, uh, in, in childhood, most of us had a fear of dogs. So we had a fear of dogs because dogs could bite, they, they, were, they were barking. So we had those fears. Now once we grow up, then we actually resolve those negative emotion of fear with a uh, thought that okay no not every dog will bite not every dog will bark at you and even if it, even if the dog barks it will not always bite you so there is hardly any incidence where uh, every dog has come to you and has barked and has bitten you so we resolve that negative emotion of fear and we come out but if somebody cannot resolve that fear then that fear can make uh, uh, can hamper the productivity of that person because of those fears this is unresolved negative emotion that will need mimulus because mimulus will take care of that unresolved negative emotion of fear of dogs. It will relieve that. It will give a positive quality of courage. Mimulus, aspen and trochros, they all give courage as the positive quality against the specific or non-specific or intense fears respectively. And once you get the positive quality of courage, then you try to look 
at the situation in a more resolved manner, in a more okay. rational manner, in a more um, logical manner, and then the fear resolves. This is how these remedies they act. So that's why we need to first understand uh, two things whenever we want to treat a patient. What are the unresolved negative emotions and what are the emotions or what are the emotional states which are actually hampering the productivity of that person. You only treat only those unresolved emotions which are hampering the productivity of any individual, either you or your patients or your friends or your relatives. Don't try to treat each and every negative emotion because each and every negative emotion does not need to be treated. Negative emotions, uh, if they are within control, if they are not bothering and hampering your productivity, they are a natural phenomena which everybody has to pass through. So we all will be sad if we fail, if we fail in some doing something. We all will be angry if something doesn't go uh, again, like like we wanted to that to happen. So all these things will happen. These are natural emotions. So you don't need to. Uh, there is no need to have a, uh, a an objective or goal or mission that. I will completely uh, nullify all the negative emotions. Don't do that because that's not going to happen. These are natural things which are going to come. Our aim or goal needs to be that they need to be resolved as early as possible so that we are always at ease. I hope you have liked uh, this these videos. You are liking these videos. Uh, please subscribe to our channel. Please share these videos with your friends and let them uh, join this this group because this this channel because we are soon going to start with an online course uh, which is free to uh, air which is I'm completely going to be uh, sharing all my uh, all my all my knowledge that I have gathered from till now uh, in a English manner in in Hindi and English uh, soon once we finish with these uh, English videos uh, so do join do share and give, send me your feedbacks on our email ID. Thank you.